Uh, today, welcome. Today we are going to look at the orthokinetic reflex in um, practical application. So Sarah's going to help me demonstrate what this reflex does. Um, it's kind of always happening throughout your body. But there's certain things that we can do uh, to influence kind of your joints and the strength of your muscles. So uh, we're, let's go ahead and get into it. Sarah, um, I'll have you sit on the floor. So what we're going to do, is sit your legs out is we're gonna test her glute meat strength. Um, I'm simply going to have her lift her leg, and then all I want you to do is just push against my hand as I pull okay. in. Okay, ready, go. Okay, so she's pretty strong right there, obviously. I can't go any further, and relax. So uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna compress her talocalcaneal joint and see how that influences her strength, okay? Um, so, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take her foot and just kind of compress that joint a little bit. Compress it. Good. And let's go ahead and retest. So, out. Go. Go. So, she no longer has any strength in her glute. Was it? Do you feel it? Okay. So, uh, similarly, we can compress the joint, make all of her strength go away. We can also open up the joint and then kind of send some information back to the brain, granting us hopefully some more strength. So she just opens up that joint a little bit more and relax. And then let's go ahead and recess. And go ahead, her strength is pretty much back. So. It's pretty cool, but you may be saying, Noah, you did something in her ankle, it clearly affects her leg. Well, we can do it in the thumb too. So I'm gonna have you bring out your thumb. It doesn't matter. So all I'm gonna do is compress this joint in her thumb. Compress. Compress, compress. Maybe one more time. And we're going to go ahead and test her glute mean strength again. And if we go, go. I have complete control over her leg. So um, the point here to illustrate is when our joints are jammed or immobile, how do we expect to have a lot of strength, a lot of flexibility, a lot of mobility? You don't. So when we open up the joints, our brain grants us flexibility, strength, and that's the beauty of it. So. Uh, thank you, Sarah, and um, lesson here, move, open up your joints, and uh, you'll be faster, stronger, more athletic, and be better. Cheers.